It's time for Lefties Losing It. Let's start with AOC. She's uh, getting a taste of her own medicine. You're going to cut this and you're going to clip this so that it's completely out of context. I already said that it was, and you're just going to pretend that it wasn't over and over again. It's up, man. You're, and you're not helping these people, TV. and you're not helping them. You refuse to. You're not helping them. Wasn't she the one who advised lefties like her to make Republicans feel uncomfortable in public, to get in their faces? Well, honey, call this instant karma. You refuse to call it a genocide. No, I, I need you to understand. It's not okay that there's a genocide happening. You're not actively against it. You're lying. I'm lying? You're not. You went on TV and avoided talking about it. Now, let's check in on the president, the leader of the free world, who is living in a state of denial. Here he is asked about his poor poll numbers. Listen to his answer. Mr. President, what's your message to Democrats who are concerned about your poll numbers? My poll numbers, the last five polls you guys don't report, I'm winning. Five. Five in a row. You guys only look at the New York Times. They're a great paper. <laughs> that poor old delusional soul. You almost feel sorry for him. Now, I love this clip so much. I have put it on my personal Instagram page. Watch as this teacher is first confused and then hopefully, I hope, she's delighted by the kids in her class uh, showing their love for this classic. Why this song? This is loud as it gets, so you guys have to be quiet. I'm so confused. I don't know, it was requested. The kids may save us yet. Now, let's have some comic content, the good and the bad. Let's start with one of our favourites, Ryan Long. We've had him on this program. Here he mocks the ginger and the winter. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have decoupled. If you are a man out there looking for a woman that can sort of, you can shack up with her, she can sort of drain every last little bit of fame you, maybe extract you from your friends, your yeah. family, sort of, uh, you know, maybe you can have some projects together that she's going to be very creatively involved in that they'll all bomb. Sure. If you're looking for something like that, Meghan Markle is officially on the market. I mean, this is the first I'm hearing of this. If okay. you're looking for a woman, yeah. they can sort of, Jada Pinkett Smith style, just her presence can sort of turn you into a laughing stock when yeah. at one point you were royalty. She can offer that. That should be in her Tinder bio. <laughs> now to Colorado, where a comedian, Nick Swartzen, I've never heard of Nick Swartzen, but he was so bad that they killed his mic and forced him off stage. Have a look at this. I mean, they turned the lights on. Yeah. And turned off the spotlight. Dude. And they turned off the mic. This is wild. Now they turned off his mic. <laughs> We decided to conclude the show early uh, in the best interest of those who bought tickets. We apologize for uh, what you've seen tonight.